Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of Mario Kart Tour. Today we're taking a look at the Baby Peach Cup Rainbow Road. How to rack up a high score on this. I managed to get 18,000 on just a couple few runs. I uh, just wanted to show you how to make, take some of the lines and take advantage of all the items. Which there are a lot of items, jump boosts and coins in this. Um, and hopefully, they'll give you a high score in this rankings. So, let's talk about Driver Kart Glider. My setup going in, I'm... Opting for to go for Pauline party time just because coin box is a huge combo uh, multiplier adder uh, and you compare it to Mount Mario fire flower flower is an alright special skill you know but on a level where there are no sides nothing to bounce off you're going to be very lucky to get some good hits out of that uh, other options include peach wedding with triple mushroom which is a good option probably second to coin box ice flower also not as good and rosalina with dash ring could be a really helpful s skill to have in terms of maintaining your combo but i went in on this run with pauline um may invest two tickets in her or gold for your running coop in the end i'm not sure then we have uh, a few options for gliders for carts and one of them being cloud nine which is at level five a jump boost plus that's going to be every single one for me. I do have Prancer, only has Slipstream Plus, not really a good option. Sweet Day Tripper, not a good option. Red B Dasher, not a good option. And Mush Cheer Mellow, Rocket Start Plus, not a good option. Then we have Kabuki Dasher with K Dash Panel Plus. So by far, Cloud9 will be the best choice for this one. Then we're looking at Gliders, and I do have Gold Glider, again coming good this week. Um, with coin plus so in combination with disco Pauline, you know, it's a no-brainer uh, You may also if you don't have that at a high level you may have new year new year's kite It's, it's kind of annoying having coin plus a high-ranking coin plus Glider on the same level. It's like well, you know You're just losing that on what could have been I could have used that on another level We also have uh, oil umbrella with red shell plus not bad Silver Bells with Super Horn Plus, and we have Silver and Gold Heart Balloons, the worst of the choice of all choices, Bullet Bill Plus. So it's a no-brainer. Coin Plus with Disco Pauline. You may not have Disco Pauline. I'm so glad I got her that time she came around. I think it was the second time she came around. She is going to massively help me on this. So let's take a look at this run. This didn't take too long to record. Right, we start this one off with a normal rocket start. So going on to holding down release. Then you want to start your turn to the right already because you're going to be mini turboing on this corner. Try and take it tight so you get you might just slip in front of people if you do that. Now you want to stay to the sides. You can even go to the right or the left side, doesn't matter. But you want to stick to the right. You'll get two jump boosts instead of one if you stay in the middle. Um, then we go into these nicely. You can get two from each of these. You can almost nick three on the last one as well. But then you want to go to the left side, get that jump boost, get those two coins. Then just do a little turn to the right and get yourself in line with that. Then it's a mini turbo quickly and a mini turbo to the left. That'll get you into this portion where you can start your turn to the right and make it all the way across here through the jump boost that you'll get there. Ignore those three coins. You will lose your combo if you go from them. It's better to, it's much safer to leave them. Unless you're going into that with a frenzy, I don't recommend going for that. Stick to the side so you'll get jump boosts here. And then you can just connect to these coins. I get two coins from the items. Another, just miss out on the jump boost there, but the coins will get you through there alone start to turn to the right so you can get those three one three there and make sure you set up nicely though for that coin coming through here it is i tend to use my item ticket you don't need to i had an ultra mini turbo it just i don't feel like there's any portion which is too difficult to lose combo may have probably been now we'll see in a bit i probably should have held it coming through the second lap doing the same again trying to get as many coins here we're getting two on that last one swinging out to the left Nicking the jump boost and one coin there and just getting set nicely for that one Then we turn left here. This is probably actually where I should be using my Coin ticket which I will be in future ones so that I'd probably recommend using it there Not the, the first place because as you see here. I get hit here and lose my combo uh, A bit quicker and I would have got through there just fine, but that guy That guy slowed me down by getting getting him away. We had a nice coin box coming through here from you know the first part of this lap this bit 
it isn't great. I mean, we keep a coin through there. We've got a banana to get us through to this bit. We if just don't make it to that coin. Um, the items and the coins there will, will make that section very easy. But as you see, if I'd have used my item ticket earlier, um, maybe later, sorry, just before we go through that long path with the hard turn, um, I may have I may have picked up a frenzy. This is a no frenzy run. I want to show you no frenzy run so that they didn't get in the way of showing how to do it. But really, that first section is so important. You can take it that way. Um, don't take the inside ramp with the two coins. It you end up take coming out uh, makes it very difficult to get too many turbos in, and you probably end up hitting the side of the track. That's why I, I, I do recommend avoiding these three coins. Which ones? The three coins around about here. Nope, no, that, that, that's around about. Ah, uh, we did just show it for that. Yeah, that's why I say don't go for these three coins. So you'll get the jump boost. And then you can release your mini turbo there, get another mini turbo in there, and you can get to the side of the track and pick up a jump boost. I just used my coin box, which I to make the best use of all the coins there. But yeah, first lap, I think was pretty perfect. Just aim for that, and eventually you'll get a good score. Um, I didn't end up getting a high score on that one. Um, on this one, I it's my highest score. But this is this is a, a coin frenzy run, um, and before I think I got a, a coin. Yeah, coin box. This is with my Pauline only at level one. I just played through it because I wasn't happy with this as a run to show you guys because it had too many frenzies in it. Um, and it wasn't great anyway. I didn't maintain my combo for, for a long portion of the track. And I took the inside track as you see there, which is not the way to go. As I say, if you get frenzy, those coins are safe. But I don't think you get enough time to be able to make that decision. Yeah, we finished with 18,300. This is one that I feel I'm, I'm going for 20,000 on this. Um, easily. 20,000. Now, now I've got Pauline at level 3. So I know I showed you it just now before this. And Pauline was at level 1. But I upped it to level 3. Which gives me the times. Maybe I should have held one of those tickets off for something else. I don't know. Maybe. I, I could... Because she's not going to be at level 4. I could have held one ticket back and got Pink Gold Peach to level 4. May have made a big mistake there. But how am I going to get another ticket? I'm not. I'm only going to get one. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. We'll see what, what the pipes provide for me. Maybe I'll be alright there. Um, but yes, this week should be pretty easy. I think the only thing I'm lacking is that Royal Raceway T Glider. Uh, we'll take a look at that run next, how to maintain combo throughout, I'd probably say, being at a trick level. I'll definitely be aiming for that. Um, but that's all for this one. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like on the video. Hit subscribe if you want to keep up to date with future content. That's all from me. See you guys soon.